Good morning, my brilliant uh, K-3A students. How is everyone's doing? How could going with your reading? So thank you for your participation. Thank uh, Sokrayut is good. Ratana. Also, uh, Riesai, you are already good on reading. Okay, so we'll come back to a new lesson today. So today's lesson is uh, consonant sounds ku, er, sh. Okay, so uh, uh, in this lesson, I'm going to teach you some words uh, that start or end with consonant ku, er, and, and sh. Alright, so you can find the consonants at the beginning or at the end. Okay, there are some words it's not easy for you to read because they are long sound words, but I will be guiding you how to read them. Just listen carefully. Okay, so before we proceed to our new lesson, let, let us uh, review the lesson that we had. Okay. These are the words with consonant sound m, mm, m, mm, p. There are a lot of words here which are not familiar to you because they are not short sound. But we, we can find these words at your book, okay? So we need to read them and also be familiar to them so that we know how to read them, okay? Alright, so consonant sound m, map, moon, mouse, mirror, mill, broom. Consonant m, nose, not, nest, nail, nine, moon, lion, train. Consonant sound p, pig, pencil, piano, peer, pitch, panda, sheep. Alright, so as I had told you a while back, you can find the consonant sound mm at the beginning. As I, at the same time, others word can find at the end. Okay, like broom, the sound of mm is at the end, and the sound mm you can find and uh, um, at the end like moon, lion. Train, but it's always the same, okay? They are uh, the same sound. Like P also, uh, the word sheep is at the end. The letter P is at the end, okay? Sheep, but the same P, okay? So there are hard words or other words that's uh, also uh, found in your book. Although some of them are not belong to m, m, p, like b, they are not belong to any of this. Doll, wolf, okay. So they are doll, b, wolf, peer, nose, mirror, broom, piano, moon, sheep, pitch, panda. So these are these words are not uh, familiar to you, okay? So it's not easy to read. And also I have uh, gave you your homework and I want you to, to listen carefully because I, uh, I found one that uh, or two of you uh, as encircle all the words here, okay? But the instruction is encircle the word that does not belong to the group. It means that you're going to, to circle only one word, okay? So number one, map, moon, peer. Peer is not belong to um sound, so I encircle peer. Number two, milk, nose, not. Nose and not are belong to uh, um sound, so milk is not belong to the group, so let's encircle milk. Number three, mirror, nest, mouse. So nest is not belong to the m sound. Number four, lion, train, room. Okay, look at the spelling. The m sound found at the end. Okay, so lion, train, they are boss, belong to m sound, wherein broom, the m is not belong to the group. So let's encircle broom. The same true with pig, 
nail pencil. Obviously, nail is not belong to let to sound poo. Okay, so circle nail. Number six, pitch nine nose. Pitch noun nine nose. And uh, pitch is not belong to um, sound, so we are going to circle pitch. Pitch peer B. So they are both long, they are both in long sound. So uh, B is not belong to the group, so we're going to circle B. Okay. So number eight, lion, train, wolf. So which one is not belong to the group? It is wolf because uh, lion and train they are belong to in sound. So let's just circle wall. And number nine, nail, panda, nest. Obviously, panda is not belong to the in sound. Okay. And the last, doll, mouse, milk. Okay, doll is not belong to um sound, so they are both belong to um sound, so doll is not belong to the group. Okay, so what they are going to read now is this one. Okay, so uh, you read by yourself and I will check whether you can read all or no. Okay, so uh, I will give you five minutes to practice this. And uh, I'll be back after five minutes. I will call your name one by one and please read by yourself. Okay? Okay, thank you for your participation and I'm so glad that you, most of you can read these words already, okay? Keep on practicing. Alright, so our lesson today is uh, consonant sound, P, R, S. Okay, so uh, before that, uh, all or most of the word that start with letter Q, Q and letter U, okay, school. All right, so all the words that start with Q, with Q always have letter U, okay, and they just add uh, any word, any letters here to complete the word, okay. So this is a Q, R, S. All right, these are the words with consonant sound, Q, R, S. All right, so Q. Quilch, 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 okay, quilch, queen, quail, quill, question mark. Again, these are not easy to read for you, so please listen carefully. Quilch, this one is letter E, quilt, quid and earth, quilt, quilt, queen. Quail, quail, quill, quill, quilt. All right. Question mark. Er sound. Rabbit, rug, run, rose, rake, ring, rake. It's a long sound. Rake, rose, rabbit, rabbit. All right. Sound. Sun, Santa, seal, soup, snake, bus, mast. Okay, most of the words here are not uh, familiar to you. This is a hard word for you. Okay, just listen carefully. Ku, quilt, letter L and T. Quilt, queen, quail, this is A, quail, quill. Question mark. Rabbit. Rug, run, rose, red, ring. Sun, sun, Santa, seal, soup, snake, bus, mass. There are the other words here, like zebra. You can find zebra in your book, okay? So I will show you later. Zebra, zoo, lake, van, key, Fox, king, nose. 
There are these words are not belong to ku, er, and s. Okay, so they are just uh, put there as selections. So again, zebra, zoo, lake, van, key, fox, king, nose. Okay, so these are the pictures. The picture of uh, the word that uh, starts or it starts with pu, pu. Okay, Q and U, pu. Or what? Look at this. Okay, this is a quilt. Okay, quilt is used to cover your bed. Quilt, quilt, queen, king, quail, key. Quitter. Question mark. Fox. Okay, look at the pictures. Be familiar with these pictures so that you know how to read the pictures. Okay, again. Quilt. Queen. King. Quail. Key. Quilt. Uh, no, quill. Question mark. Fox. These are the, the words that start with consonant sound er. Rug, rabbit, run, rose, rake, ring. Other here are rabbit, nose, lake. They are not belong to R, but uh, they just put their selections. Okay, again, rug, run, rake, rose, ring, rabbit. And consonant sound Sun, seal, soup, bus, Santa, snake, mast. This is a zebra. This is a zoo. Okay. Again. Sun, seal, soup, bus, mast, snake, Santa. This is a zoo. This is a zebra. Okay. So uh, you're going to do this later. Okay, so I have something to, to read for you. Okay, so uh, be familiar with this. I'll be back. I will be, uh, read this that again later. Okay, for the additional reading, you're going to answer it's a. Okay, so uh, uh, this is not part of your activity. So just part of your uh, task, uh, no, it's part of video one. So just want to practice you how to answer properly, okay? So uh, number one, what's this? What's this? This is a question mark, okay? What's this? You're going to answer it's a, so what's this? It's a rabbit. It's a rabbit. Number two, what's this? It's a sun. What's this? It's a ring okay it's a ring number four another question is this a fish you're going to answer no it isn't it's a snake and number five is this a rug yes it is okay so i wrote this in order for you to know how to answer a question Okay, so I will uh, read it again for you so that you know how to answer question. Okay, number one, what's this? It's a rabbit. Number two, what's this? It's a sun. Number three, what's this? It's a ring. Number four, is this a fish? No, it isn't. It's a snake number five is this a rug yes it is okay so when somebody asks you about these questions at least you know how to answer properly okay and again uh, i will give you maybe six minutes to practice this chart uh, word with consonant ku er and s Okay, so uh, I know who is not easy for you to read, so I will be guiding you before that time, or I will be guiding you again after this, okay? 
All right. So uh, please use use the voice message for checking your reading. Okay. I'll be back after six minutes. Okay, here we are. This is your activity one, activity two, okay? So listen carefully. I'm going to give you another kind of activity. All right, so here, okay, task number one, you are going to check if the pair of words have the same consonant sound. Mm? Mm? Consonant sound, ku, er, sh, okay? So, mark X if not. For example, number one, queen, quilt. Are they uh, uh, the same Q? Queen, quail. Yes, the, they have the same, uh, they are the same Q, okay? So, you're going to check. Number two, quail, ray. Are they the same? Are they belong to uh, are they belong to the same sound? Quail, ray. Is it Q and are the same? No, it's, they are not the same. So you are going to write X, okay? Number three, rabbit, rose. Are they belong to the same sound? Er, er. So they, have, they are the same er. So you are going to check, okay? For number four, Ring king. Look at the beginning sound. Are they belong to the same sound or the same uh, consonant sound er or king? Okay, so please analyze that. Number five, sun run. Look at the beginning sound. Number six, bus snake. Are they belong to the same sound? Number seven, zeal question mark. Seal question mark. Number eight, soup rose. Are they the same? Look at the spelling, okay? S and R, are they the same? All right. Then number nine, run mass. R and M, mm, are they the same sound? No. Okay, number 10, rose nose. Are they belong to the same consonant sound? R or Q or S? Okay, so mark or check if they are the same. Mark X if not. Okay, so this is your task number one. You are going to copy this in your notebook. Okay, so do answer it by yourself. For the task number two, you are going to write who again, the same thing. Okay, so write who if you hear the sound Cool. Okay, like quail. You're going to write cool. Letter Q and letter U. Okay, so there are two letters there. Quilt, queen, king. King is not Q. Do not write anymore. Just write quilt and queen. All right. So number two or row two. Quail, key, quilt or quilt. Quail, key, quill. So write who for quail. Letter uh, key is not belong to who. Do not write anything here. And quill is belong to who, so write who. Number uh, third row, question mark, who. Question, so you're going to write who. Fox is not who, so do not write. Okay, so this is the instruction. Do not write if not sound cool. Then at page 24, er, rug one rabbit. Rug one rabbit. Just write er if the picture is er. Then run rose nose. Okay, just write. R or write letter R if the picture is belong to R. Okay, rake, ring, lake. Rake, ring, lake. Okay, write R if you hear the consonant sound R. 
Okay, at page 25, you're going to write letter S if you hear the sound S. Okay, sun, zebra, Santa. Is zebra belong to letter S? I think no, so do not write letter Z, okay? Zeal, bus, snake. Seal, bus, snake, okay? Soup, zoo, mast. Soup, zoo, mast. Write letter S if you hear the sound of sound S, okay? So do it by yourself. I hope that uh, all pictures were colored already because your homework is uh, to color all the pictures at page uh, 21, 22, uh, 23, 24, and 25. Okay, so do it by yourself and of course I will check your activities. Please uh, drop it on our page so that I can also give you your score. Okay, so for the last video, I'm going to give you your homework. Okay, finally, this is your homework. Please listen carefully. All right, so uh, at page 26, you're going to color all the animals. Okay, what are the animals? Uh, turtle, goat, bat. Dog, cat, and tiger. These are animals, okay? So what you're going to do is just color, okay? So at page 27 and 28, 27 and 28, you're going to color all the things, okay? You know what are the things, things to use? For example, at page 27 and 28, what are the things here? like a van so that is the things uh, used to ride okay van fan globe violin what else watch wig uh, what else a fan vest okay so these are the things all right so you're going to color also okay so remember at page 26, you're going to color all the animals. At page 27 and 28, you're going to color all the things, okay? Things to use, okay? So that's your homework. Please do your homework. And I want to see your homework and check on uh, Friday, okay? Thank you for your participation. Thank you for your listening and please practice okay so see you on friday bye bye